सो हाई व्यूवर्स वेलकम टू फील यूवर्स फुल थैंक यू फॉर वाचिंग आई हैड सम स्मॉल नैप सो स्टिल इन द स्लीपिंग मोड इट इज नॉट अ स्लीप बट अ डीप नैप आई थिंक सो टूडे रीडिंग इज इट इज अबाउट हु इज डिमिंग और हु इज ट्राइंग टू डिम यूवर लाइट ओके सो वॉट एग्जैक्टली इट मीन्स इज someone who don't want to see, see you shine or as simple as you may be doing something with your confidence with your creativity something some idea you may be want to execute so somewhere you are going to get successful someone may be around you don't want to see that you should get successful uh, so as simple as uh, let it be uh, i don't want to take it in a, like a that extend also as simple as uh, there are group of people okay and in that group of people you may be like uh, party of the life kind of person or the moment you get like you are a very bubbly cheerful happy kind of person so even though the, no matter how that group is the moment you enter into that group it is like suddenly the entire group will become cheerful happy positive it happens okay so you may be carry such kind of energy simply we may be near. people will be there lot of positive motivating people are at least uh, very cheerful very active those people wherever they go they bring some kind of positivity some kind of uh, excitement uh, even though in that uh, group people some people are lazy also the moment uh, that cheerful person comes entire group will feel very active very happy joyful it is a normal thing right but still someone may be in that group or out of that group who don't like that you are a very bubbly cheerful joy happy kind of person they may be don't like so they may be try to do something to as simple as spoil your mood disappoint you uh, make you sad about something uh, if at all uh, uh, one small example uh, why people are cheerful happy because they accept themselves as they are they don't care about what dress i wear whether people are going to like my dress whether i am looking good today whether i am a beautiful they don't care about all those they are just happy within themselves as they are that's where the, such kind of people wherever they go they bring that happiness they bring they bring that joy but uh, someone out of that group or in inside that group also they feel some kind of uh, you know this person came now attention will be it is not that they want to grab that attention as simple as their, their nature itself is like positive vibing kind of person the moment uh, they come everyone focus will be on that person so someone may be definitely they don't like so they are like oh, we need to do something so they will be like ah oh, what happened today you are looking different your dress is like that your dress is like this and today your lips are like something which they try to do that actually uh, you should not be in that good mood uh, they try to uh, pick something not exactly like a criticism they try to pick some small thing so that you can feel disappointed okay as simple ah there is a gray hair why oh, you did not color your hair if at all you are like me i don't care <laughs> some people mostly that cheerful people won't care if at all you are like star you will be shine no matter where you keep no matter where people want to keep you you will shine no one can stop your shine okay so today our topic will be based on that no see i feel personally everyone hold their own light it is not that only anita is light anita is bright anita is like a star no each and every person living being hold unique light within them the only thing is some people know that light and they will bring that light out they will share that light with others some people do they don't even want to know what is their light they don't even want to if at all they know also some people don't want to come out they don't want to show their light to others some people completely they go into darkness they don't even want to see the light it's different but every living being on this planet 
say one rose plant when fresh rose comes don't you think it is a light how beautiful it is how we feel different when we saw that beautiful rose when it blooms when it become flower still it is in the plant it is still with the plant we feel very wow that is nothing but that rose how that shine in that way everyone hold that light but as i said some people will be dark they don't want to see their own light they may be have their own issues as some people like they sh- they know their light but how oh, no what people will think if at all i show them what people will think if at all i act like that maybe it is their unique that is what their uniqueness that is what their light but they feel about other people's opinions judgment so they hide they hide their light uh, because of that whoever don't see their light do don't want to see the light whoever out of opi- fear of opinions judgment who don't want to bring their light out these kind of people try to uh, dim other people's light whoever showing who want to show that light who want to be like themselves like that's it it is not that particular they want to bring the light and they just want to leave their light that's it so today our top topic will be like that you may be have definitely some light knowingly or unknowingly as simple as you may be dress up very well every day no matter what no matter boss what <laughs> boss is going to tell no matter this month you reach the target or not no matter this month you re- received the incentives or not nothing when you are going to the office you are like no adita i want to make up i want to dress up i want to look fabulous and i want to go to the office i don't care after going to the office whether my boss is going to shout at me my reporting manager is going to shout i don't even care so that presenting yourself in a beautiful way that beautiful presentation is your light okay maybe you know it or not but the moment you enter in the oh she came today what she wore how she is looking that is also one light people who are don't want to show interest also after looking at you they also want to wear such dresses they want to they also want to make up they also want to dress up they also want to look good like you present themselves like you it is also one kind of light so who want to dim your light as i said if at all you are that kind of person you are boss or your reporting manager may be very sadistic person psycho kind of person when they they don't they know that every day you look good you make up you dress up well so they will be like hmm, this person always comes good i want to spoil their mood the moment you enter what is the time 5 minutes why 5 minutes late it is just 5 minutes but they won't take it as a jest because they want to dim your light they want to disappoint you they want to spoil your mood that's how people will be we are surrounded by that from that small incident to something huge which you want to do in a huge level you want to bring some kind of huge change in the masses you want to motivate people you want to bring people on the light side that is a huge thing from small thing to that huge thing every step of our life there will be people who try to stop or dim our light okay it is natural it is not strange thing today our focus will be that kind of people and who is doing that in your life how to handle it okay if at all possible we will see one karma so in the end we will pick one two cards for that person's karma okay <laughs> so one pile is enough who is trying to dim your light and uh, one is enough if you want to see multiple piles because i think today we got all the good piles four of wands three of cups ace of swords lovers there is at least two for you people like a 10 of swords no <laughs> and so if at all you want multiple piles you can watch but I, as always say stick some time between the piles don't watch continuously okay even though it is not going to trigger you because it is about your light i want to highlight what is your light so that even though you are not aware of it after watching this reading you can concentrate on that more okay so that no matter who is trying to dim your life you you light you no need to dim for them okay you no need to stop shining okay 
so as well as as i said if at all you need to be cautious you need to do something about that situation you can follow the suggestion okay you will get the suggestion listen to your intuition and uh, if you think that yes everything is matching yes so and so person this is how they behave whenever i feel happy they try to do something to make me sad make me disappointed that is nothing but they just want to uh, dim your light okay they don't want to see you happy you, what you should do in that cases okay you will get the suggestion listen to your intuition and go with that suggestion so i hope cards are visible okay uh, it is a mobile i i record from the mobile so don't uh, um, expect lot of clarity okay uh, i think 720 clarity i think i use 720 pixel resolution maybe default it is 320 it may be default but you can increase the resolution okay i check the cards actually it is a visible some people may be said that uh, cards are not clear okay at least uh, adjust that <laughs> so these are our cards so let's get into the reading so pile number 1 who choose four of wands Okay, so whoever chose four of wands, who is trying to? Because I don't think they dim your light. No one can dim your light, but try to dim your light. Okay, who is trying to dim your light? What you should do? <laughs> so meanwhile, go and subscribe. If at all you not subscribe, if at all you already subscribe, thank you for the subscription. Click the join button and have a look at our YouTube store. and watch the ad so pile number 1 who is trying to dim your light dimming or trying to dim your light pile number 1 who is trying to dim your light someone who in your life who is like a ten of wands okay they are carrying lot of burdens on their shoulders you ended the cycle with that person maybe see it is like a ten of wands you already carry a lot of burdens so what what you are going to do with the ten of wands or what i am going to do with you with the ten of wands maybe uh, you ended the cycle they got heartbroken maybe they thought that even though i am holding ten of wands you will be with them but you are like okay you already have lot in your plate where you are going to put me <laughs> <laughs> that's where you maybe ended the cycle now they are in the heartbreak they may be expected that you will maybe you are going to take their responsibility or take take their burdens the devil who is dimming your light okay ah devil seven of pentacle in the reverse who is dimming dimming your light so actually this person is obsessed with you maybe because of that obsession it became ten of wands for this person because here i am not seeing they hold any kind of responsibilities more than that it is obsession towards you they are like a devil they have lot of obsession and that obsession become out of control which is like they are on the edge they need to come out of it or else they will get the tower movement like ego death kind of thing to become heavy for them but you 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 saw that maybe you understood that it is a devil energy you no need to deal with the devils that's where you ended the cycle they broke they feel at least to you you broke their heart maybe they tried hard to get you but they failed because seven of pentacle in the reverse the reason you are like a queen of swords you are not carrying any kind of emotions towards this person if at all you are like a devil i am like a queen of swords you may be set strong healthy boundaries to them or you are like if at all you come towards me i am going to cut your throat but they are completely keeping tabs on you maybe this person is not even sleeping at night even though we did not got that cards but it is ten of wands that became becoming or already became heavy for this person to hold that weight whatever passion they carry for you are obsession more than passion obsession obsessive energy uh, you ended the cycle with this person what is your light because here who is dimming your light this person is dimming your light maybe i don't know why what they are doing to dim your light because you are not in their life that's for sure 
what is they what they are doing to dim your life they want to create some kind of drama because you are, you may be a very single abundant person you may be very single abundant person okay you may be have a lot of options in your life options <laughs> sometimes <laughs> you are single abundant and you have a lot of options and when you you are in this good energy if some devil come towards you what you will do obviously you will become queen of swords because you don't want to spoil your energy high vibration for someone right or you don't let anyone to come and disturb your vibration that's what you are doing keeping strong healthy boundaries if at all they are still coming with the death devil energy you don't hesitate to kill the devil because it is not a human it is a devil and they are completely focused on you and what they are doing to dim your light is they are creating lot of drama because they want to bring you in five of pentacle because you are already nine of pentacle so you are like an abundant single abundant independent materialistically stable grounded they want to bring you in five of pentacle so that you you should feel like in the poverty you should feel like i need someone i need some help i don't like this person's energy but anyway uh, it is not much affecting me that is the reason so this person intention is like maybe they went into the five of pentacle because seven of pentacle in the reverse they try hard to get get you but uh, they failed that's why now they end up in the five of pentacle now they want to create the drama which is like they want to make you to lose your mental peace because your energy is very good your energy is like at least two vibration is very high nine of pentacle very clean neat high vibration kind of energy very privileged person kind of energy where you are not entertaining anyone to become burden to bring the drama to bring any kind of nuisance that's how you are maintaining yourself and you have a lot of options when you have nine of pentacle means you have a lot of options no matter it is not just in the sense of relationships anything they want to create the drama they want to create some kind of conflicts arguments verbal fights where you should lose your mental peace that's how when you enter into if you allow these things what will happen you will lose your mental peace when you lose your mental peace what will happen obviously you are going to lose this vibration so they want to bring down that vibration so that this devil energy can enter into your energy because when someone is very obsessive no matter what you do even though you are staying away from them they still uh, present in your energy but when you vibrate high that's why we say when you get this kind of energies keep yourself in good atmosphere you are already in the good atmosphere and moreover you are like a queen of swords you are not you don't care if anyone try to disturb you anyone try to disturb your vibration that is also one reason maybe they are doing lot because seven of pentacle in the reverse they may be did lot but nothing affected <coughs> you you got you are not affected you are still vibing high so who try to dim your light this person try to dim dim your light this devil try to dim your light but you are shining bright they fail to dim your light what they are doing is trying to bring the drama Try, trying to create some kind of conflicts mental conflicts because it is five of swords so that you won't shine bright why they are doing as i said you ended the cycle with them you broke their heart actually it is a devil they won't carry any heart but ego okay they you got you hurted their ego so now they are like i want to come i want to enter i want to spoil your energy i want to dim your light but it is not affecting you because you are vibing very high this devil cannot reach you and moreover not just that you are holding the sword you are not dropping the sword if at all you drop the sword they can enter but you are holding the sword they'll fear fear of they feel fear of your sword what you need to do 
what you should do about this why being high is good thing eight of wands you should be in a good vibration okay if at all you have any one in your life who is like a divine feminine you need to get that person in your life you need to get married or you need to get into the union with them okay because you are a single person till the time you are single this devil is behind you i am not saying it is affecting you but uh, still they try to do this thing that thing maybe morning to evening it is only work for them to disturb you <laughs> to try to dim your light so that they want to see you in pain or at least they want to see you in some kind of disturbance uh, they want to see you some kind of mental conflicts mental pressure stress that kind of thing they don't want you to be in this nine of pentacle energy like yes abundant free kind of energy so for you what you should do is you have someone in your life who is like a divine feminine who is like your wish fulfillment go towards that person maintain equal give and take have some eight of wands new beginning okay because here the thing is you may be as of now you may be not showing interest in love that is the reason you don't want to go towards divine feminine even though you know that this divine feminine is your wish fulfillment so now that is a where you are like a nine of pentacle if you go towards them you will end up in the connection relationship with someone then this devil is not going to be behind see i don't entertain this kind of things because what i feel is because someone behind you you should get married no i don't feel you handle it okay if at all someone is behind you try to disturb you try to do something destroy you it is not that you need to get the partner to deal with such kind of idiots you can deal with okay you can deal with them but i think here somewhere what i am seeing is you are the one it is like a test I, as i said some, everything whatever happen in our life it is for a reason you are the one who is not showing interest in love but you already have someone in your life who is like a wish fulfillment but you are not interested in love that is the reason you are not going towards them you are not you don't want to have this equal give and take you don't want to have this eight of wands you don't want to come into the union what universe doing is whatever this devil is doing it is like okay devil do that because this person is not going to get a marry if at all you disturb them you try to disturb them anyway universe won't allow them to disturb you it is like you may be a very strong personality because you are already queen of swords but what universe is telling you is go because it is not that you need to marry them forcefully it is you you it is your wish fulfillment and you also maintain equal give and take with them you both can build together it is a four of wands and you both can have a lot of new beginnings and maybe it is your divine feminine your divine counterpart so it is it may be the time of union you are the one who is okay i'm single i'm abundant i'm happy i don't want to go you are not showing interest in love that is a reason what you, you should do is go towards your divine counterpart you already know it is not that you don't know if at all you come to me and tell that no anita i don't have any divine counterpart <laughs> and then sit with yourself and ask who is that person who is your wish fulfillment you will get the answer okay and let me see one two cards what is the karma for this devil death what is this card maybe with you the situation is going to end or regardless this person is going to die the reason is 10 of wands maybe they are already drained their energy but they are not seeing because they are completely operating with their ego they are not in the human being mode so when they it is ego they don't even care whether what is happening with their own body is it is their karma either their ego death are physical death i cannot say you will listen to your intuition if at all you listen to your intuition you are going to get the victory with your divine counterpart okay this person cannot dim your light they just you are rejected them that is the reason why they want they are behind you that you should not shine if at all you rejected someone now you are enjoying your single hood they are like no you should not enjoy your single hood you should be like me because see i am like <laughs> obsessed not even sleeping 
feeling burden you should also feel like that we are all just stardust I am the cosmic heart. You just open your heart chakra. Why you are not opening? Why you are not showing interest in love? I don't know. But listen to your intuition. Go towards your divine counterpart. You are going to get the victory. Let me pull one card. What is this? We are all just stardust. Maybe you carry some ego. That is the reason you are not going. Hmm. See, don't get triggered. If at all you carry, I am not saying exactly like ego. Pride kind of thing. I don't go towards them. Then take that first step, okay? Because it is nothing wrong if at all go you go towards them. It is nothing wrong because uh, you may be the empress. That's where you are thinking, or the person whomever you are interested in, they are an empress. But you need to go because see, divine feminine. And what we say, divine feminine want to go, want to chase anything. Everything comes towards the divine feminine. So you need to go towards the divine feminine. Don't feel pride if at all you are feeling. Why should I go, Anita? It is a relationship, and moreover, it is your wish fulfillment. Moreover, you are getting equal give and take kind of connection. Whatever you are giving, they will also give. Moreover, you are going to get lot of victory, success in that connection. With that connection, let that pride aside. Keep that pride aside and go and build something beautiful together. Okay. Thank you for watching. So, panel number two, who choose three of cups? Okay, so whoever choose three of cups, who try to dim your light? Okay. So, meanwhile, go and subscribe. If at all you not subscribe, if at all you already subscribe, thank you for the subscription. Click the join button and have a look at our YouTube store. Watch the ads. So, who is trying to dim my panel number two's light? I want to know. <laughs> Hi, again we got the same card in our hands. Hey, this person's work is dimming everyone's light. <laughs> oh, who is trying to dim my pile number two slide? Hmm. Who is trying to dim my pile number two slide? Someone, pile number one also same person came out. Maybe you are also dealing with pile number one. Uh, just go to the pile number one reading also, okay? Uh, because you pick three of cups, right? Maybe it is friend circle, maybe. Someone in your life who is holding a lot of burdens on their shoulders, at least they are feeling like, I am the only one who is having a lot of responsibilities on my, on my shoulders. And they behave like 60, 50 years. They don't carry any kind of passion, fire and all. At least they feel that I have a lot on my plate. You ended everything with that person. Ten of swords. Okay? You ended everything and now you are like, I just want to love myself. I want to give self-love to myself. I want to give this cup to myself because I want to find the true love. <laughs> Maybe you are watching my readers, uh, readings and Anita said, first love yourself. When you focus on your love, when you love yourself, you are going to attract the love. And that's where you may be completely focusing on yourself. You are not giving your energy time to anyone love to anyone you are simply loving and that's where uh, someone trying to take plunge towards you it is your true love ace of cups this person want to take plunge towards you they don't know whether you are going to accept them or not but they want to take the plunge they want to come towards you because you are like a queen of cups but as of now you turned your back to everyone offering that cup to yourself okay you ended everything with this 10 of wands person maybe it is a very heavy their heaviness maybe they are bringing that heavy uh, some people will be there they hold it is not that when i say 10 of wands it is not that they hold a lot of passion fire ideas work sometimes karma heavy karma they hold wherever they go people in their life whomever they deal with they also feel a lot of heaviness actually they won't carry any burden but still if at all they deal with that person whoever carrying lot of karma on their shoulders whomever get into that person's life no matter friendship just to spend half an hour with them 10 minutes with them also 
after that you are going oh, what is this why i am feeling very heavy it is like i carried a lot of weight after coming with them you are going to feel like ah, i threw that burden i am feeling like i threw that burden so it is their energy energetically they are carrying lot of karma kind of thing or some kind of burden energetically so you ended everything with that person you don't want to deal with this kind of heavy energies maybe and uh, someone who is like a fool as of now they want to take the plunge towards you they want to start something new with you even though they have any kind of past they want to uh, like start their life completely with a new fresh note why this person is trying to dim your light six of pentacle why they are trying to dim your light maybe it is your friend circle go and watch pile number 1 also okay why they are trying to dim your light because why i said is in the pile number 1 also they are keeping taps on them that's why i said it is not that they are carrying means 10 of vans it is not that they are a lot of work busy no this person energetically feeling very heavy that can be karma that can be their own thoughts own things whatever they have in their life but i think as a person they may be very free because in the pile number 1 also they are completely keeping taps on the other person in your case also they are completely keeping taps on you they don't want to change if at all you are expecting this person is going to change don't expect they are not going to change their karma this is a beautiful thing opening your heart chakra experience the love experience the feelings is a beauty their karma they never going to open their heart chakra they never going to this like they never going to get love in their life that's what i am getting message but you are loving yourself attracting true love you are going to maintain equal give and take with someone who is ready to take plunge towards you so that is the reason they want to dim your light because they are not get, this person is something different because definitely i never suggest go and watch pile number 1 because someone who is having lot of burdens on their shoulders which is like a karma thing it is not physical burdens it is not that they are paying other people's bills they are taking responsibilities of their family children no they may be carrying lot of karma they are they want to project that karma on others or at least this person energy how i am feeling is they are not in a position to love someone at least to feel emotions because ten of wands itself is like some karma heavy huge karma now when they are seeing around them people are getting low uh, in, in entering into relationships they cannot bear it that's why they are trying to dim your light so that you should not get low that's what they want to do it is their karma they are if at all they are in the 10 of wands they don't they are not getting love in their life not getting love from others is different self love also they cannot do that is their karma now i don't know what they did because of that they are going through that karma so what they are doing to dim your light yeah same person obsession what is this pile number 1 and 2 you choose three three of cups i think this is your friend group someone in your friend circle friend group this person is a devil they are not a human maybe they sold their soul to the sold their soul to the demon now when you sell your soul <laughs> today i am feeling you know i am <laughs> pronouncing some words it is really feeling different so when they sold when someone sold their soul she sells their soul to the demon demon won't let them to get into the light side because you already sold yourself to me your soul to me so your show, soul should not enter into the light side and what is the light side love love is the light side light energy and this person cannot come into that light side they cannot enter into that light side that's where whoever come across them they are in the dark side 
devil whoever come across them light they don't want anyone to get light because they cannot have it it is nothing to do personal it is nothing personal with you maybe whoever comes if at all it is a friend it is not that they are your friend you are getting love that is the reason why they are no even though it is a strangers as simple as if at all this person is there two couple are very happy very loving very caring in front of them they don't even know who is that couple still this person can send that evil eye to that couple that kind of energy this is because they cannot have it maybe they want they desiring to have that love but they cannot the reason they already sold their soul to the demon and this is their karma they never going to experience love in their life that is their karma so it is your friend unfortunately <clears throat> and uh, you may be taking plunge towards or you are loving yourself you are finding your true love that person true love who may be loving yourself loving you they may be taking plunge towards you to maintain equal give and take if at all in the past they failed to maintain equal give and take now they are ready to maintain equal give and take because they understood you are their true love that's why they are coming towards you and this person you ended everything with them that's why they are feeling like they are keeping taps on you complete keeping taps on you but it is their karma that they cannot open their heart chakra even they cannot experience love that's it so why what they are doing same devil energy obsessive energy obsession maybe we like kind of thing they are sending how they are affecting is there anything that they are affecting something in some way they are confusing you with that obsession energy they are keeping some kind of mental confusion they are keeping you in some kind of mental confusion where are uh, you really like shall i take the plunge if at all you are the one who is want to take the plunge towards your queen of cups then they are keeping you in confusion if at all you are the one who is queen of cups then even though they are keep trying to keep you in this two of swords you are listening to your intuition because queen of cups is completely listening to your intuition you are doing that okay this person energy is not affecting you they what they are doing to dim your light is trying to keep you in confusion two of swords energy but uh, you are loving yourself that is the reason they cannot break your connection with your intuition even though it is a devil energy what is their karma because first pile number 1 i got something different what is their karma <coughs> maybe this person is what is this seven of pentacles they try to heal themselves but they never they try to heal themselves they try to open their heart chakra but they cannot because as i said this devil already present they are in the prison of devil energy they sold their soul they sold their soul they try to heal either i don't know what is this relation emperor and king of wands so they may be have two people they try to heal for this people at least they want to get one person or they want to become emperor and king of wands after healing they cannot but here no it, it is no need to heal heart chakra here maybe two people are there in their life but uh, not healing themselves that is the reason they are going to miss these two people and they will stuck on them they are going to stuck on them they cannot get love the reason is as i said they sold their soul to the demon now they are trying hard they will try hard to maybe come out of the devil they will try but i don't think they are going to get successful for you the suggestion is you can manifest your every wish you are the magician if at all you don't know if at all you really not don't know or you are don't think that you are a magician also now you are loving yourself queen of cups so when you are surrounded with this kind of good energy like loving yourself completely surrounded by love and moreover you are connected to your intuition 
then that is nothing but you are connected to the universe so communication with the universe is clear no blockages that time whatever you communicate with the universe universe is going to hear and it is going to give you whatever you want that is nothing but manifestations okay just ask to the universe you can manifest every, every wish you don't know manifestation also just ask to the universe send someone good or if at all you already have someone in your life who is like a true love please universe send my true love into my life i'm praying you send my true love in my life that is enough okay the universe will send your true love into your life but you connect with the universe don't lose the connection with the universe this devil is not going to affect your light uh, <clears throat> i walk with the surface way maybe it is this whatever happening with this devil energy it is like a for your ascension journey it is helping you to get on your ascension journey or it is helping you to come on your north node kind of thing okay uh, so this devil whatever they are doing it is helping as simple as you maybe need to become queen of cups you may be not becoming now whatever they are the devil is doing you are not getting any other option than loving yourself universe will tell you love yourself i may be tell you love yourself you are not listening now this devil is doing lot of things now you are like say please i just want to love myself <laughs> you became king of cups maybe become king queen of cups itself is like your destiny or magician is your destiny but to become magician first you need to connect with the intuition that is very important universe okay if at all you won't connect you will become black magician maybe universe want you to connect with the universe okay thank you for watching so panel number 3 who choose ace of swords okay so who may ever choose ace of swords who is trying to dim your light okay who is trying to dim your light so meanwhile go and subscribe if at all you are not subscribe if at all you already subscribe thank you for the subscription click the join button and have a look at our youtube store watch the ads so who is dimming your light or trying to dim your light eight of wands who is trying to dim your light ah uh, five of pentacle in the reverse who is trying to dim your light what is i think someone in your life who is codependent on you at least materialistically they want some new beginning with you because now you may be left them or you are trying to leave them because now you may be learning how to love yourself and you are completely listening to your intuition and uh, you are taking stand for yourself like i am going to do what is good for me i am going to do what is what i want to do that kind of things which is like just loving yourself so when you love yourself you don't let anyone to tell you what you need to do or if at all something is happening wrong someone is taking advantage of you you will take stand for yourself i'm not going to entertain this kind of behavior so finally you are doing that okay you are loving yourself you are listening to your intuition you are taking stand for yourself and someone is completely codependent on you if at all you leave them they will end up in the poverty or abandonment issues they want a new beginning with you eight of wands if at all they are not in the communication they want to communicate with you if at all you are not interacting with them they want to interact with you they want to have connection at least activities they want to come to you they want to uh, speak to you they want to work with you whatever activities you both used to do together they want to do with you but as of now your energy is like no no one is i am completely drained or i just want to spend time with myself by doing self love self care that is what your energy and you may be completely listening to your intuition or there may be some secrets let me pull one more card for this moon card what is this moon hanged man it is like you are not taking any action you are stuck and this person is like you may be going to leave them you may be going to take stand for yourself maybe something they did or what is this hanged man
maybe you have ten of pentacle with someone so they feel that you are going you you are started loving yourself so that means now you are going to listen to your intuition and you are going to do what is good for you and uh, you know you have ten of pentacle with someone you are going to take stand for yourself and you are going to move towards that person and when you leave them what will happen they will end up in the poverty or dip, uh, abandonment issue because this person is codependent on you it may be in the sense of money it may be in the sense of just love and care maybe you used to take care of them you used to there for them they are completely codependent on you so now you few move forward in your life for your better life they will end up in the abandonment issue and they want to communicate with you they want to have meet you they want to meet you they want to take some action they want to do in the past if at all you go together you did something activities and all now they again want it but you are not showing interest what they are doing to dim your light that that person is dimming your light so what they are doing to dim your light what they are doing to dim your light not seeing anything wrong here i'm not saying they are doing anything to dim your light but uh, what they are doing is if at all you are the person uh, somewhere they feel that if at all you leave them they will end up in the abandonment issue so somewhere they feel that if at all they leave you you are also going to feel in that way that's where maybe they uh, they want to choose someone else over you because it is a choices card lovers so whomever you are dealing with this person have someone else uh, if at all they are showing you that if at all you leave me i will be end up in the poverty no if at all you leave me i will end up in the abandonment issue no i don't think so the reason is they ha- maybe it is a secret they are not showing that they are hiding they they have someone else. see here choices card they have someone you have someone so they, what they want how what they are doing is they want to go towards their person they want to maintain equal give and take they want to heal themselves they want to open their heart chakra they want to offer cup of love they want to have friendship with them nothing to do with you as simple as see if at all you leave them okay what will happen they feel that they are codependent on you if at all you choose yourself you listen to your intuition you are going to move towards someone you are going to have ten of pentacle okay because they know that you are going to take stand for yourself but they have backup plan kind of thing it is not that yes if at all you leave them they are going to end up in the poverty or abandonment no actually if at all you leave them they have some backup plan that backup plan is they are going towards someone who can help them with them they they want to maintain equal give and take see if at all leave them if at all you leave them they will end up in the five of pentacle okay but immediately they will go towards someone they'll ask for help who is ready to help them they already have someone because lovers they have two people you and someone and for that person they even share some love or they even have carry some emotions uh, so here it is a choices card it is not that uh you are the one only have someone in your life so when you leave them they will end up in the poverty they will end up in the abandonment issues no i don't think so so what they are doing to dim your light is uh they have their own thing so when you leave them they will go to that person so if at all you are leaving you are choosing someone for the ten of pentacle i will choose someone because with them i will get my six and six of pentacle equal give and take is there anything they are doing her friend who oh, they want to marry maybe it is like <laughs> they have love so they want to go towards that person they want to offer cup of love that person is knight of cups they want to get marry maybe it is like you may be never going to get them back how they are dimming your light i don't think here exactly dimming the light kind of thing 
but it is some way see they try to stop you how they are doing is maybe they are trying to keep some kind of mental stuckness like trying to create some kind of mental stuckness some kind of insecurities fears kind of thing as simple as if at all you go towards them what is the guarantee you are going to build enough mental what is the guarantee that person is going to take care of you what is the guarantee they, that person is going to accept you they want to create some kind of mental stuckness that's it that's how they want to dim so that you can, because of that mental belief systems mental stuckness you cannot move forward with you should be stuck with them so that they no need to end up in the fire of pentacle but still they feel that you are going to leave them because you are loving yourself maybe this person knows that if at all you love yourself if at all you listen to your, your intuition no one can stop you that is the reason they already made one backup plan which is like the moment you leave them they will go towards someone with whom they can maintain that equal give and take and they have feelings for that person they want to get married with them it is their love but they are staying with you just because of because of codependency issues what do you should do see when we have people with codependency issues this is the worst thing what we face with them because of their own codependency issues they stop other people's growth what you should do become queen of swords self strong healthy bonders to this person don't care whatever they are telling if at all they tell that i am going to end up in the poverty and all still don't care just to become queen of swords set strong healthy boundaries listen to your intuition love yourself whatever your intuition is guiding move towards that direction okay because they have their thing the only thing is out of codependency they want to stop you if at all you listen to them you stop there first of all you are going to lose your abundance whatever it is and they are also not going to get their love because they also have some love but they don't want to go towards that because they need to heal themselves to get the love maybe they are not showing interest in healing staying with you is easy thing because they no need to heal because you are handling you are bearing them even though they are codependent on you even though they are keeping you stuck you are bearing with them <laughs> that's what i am feeling what is their karma what is their karma so their karma is they are going to see the truth about someone in their life who is like a queen of wands who is a juggler i don't know who is this queen of wands who is the juggler but they are going to see the truth they are going to find out the truth that this queen of wands is a juggler or if at all two people are there in their life one is a juggler one is a queen of wands they are going to see some kind of truth about them like seeing the true colors i can say what is the truth maybe something they are going to see which is don't leave any other option than working on themselves they are going to find out some truth about some people in their life uh, after finding the truth after seeing the truth they won't be having any other option than working on themselves because maybe somewhere they are they have options they are not showing as of now because you are there for them so they don't need to worry about the options because they are codependent on you and you are bearing with their, their codependency issues you are stopping yourself you are stopping your growth you are sacrificing your growth for them now if you walk away if you choose whatever your intuition is guiding then they won't be having any other option than working on themselves listening to their intuition okay that is their karma because even though this person want to run away from their intuition maybe this is a escapist kind of energy i am seeing who is running away from their own home intuition is our home who is running away from themselves you become queen of swords set strong healthy boundaries to this person their codependency should not stop your growth you are shine you they should not dim your light okay they have backup plan actually you never needed those wings to fly you are the one actually this person just codependent that is the reason they are stopping you 
uh, they want to keep you stuck in the situation by telling so and so things so that you cannot listen to your intuition you should be in the eight of swords energy like lot of confusion lot of fears lot of stuckness who is wrong who is right what is right it is okay to take that plunge it is okay to go towards that person it is all this person's creation in your brain mental manipulation kind of thing mentally they want to keep you stuck so out of that fear insecurity you won't leave them so they have codependency so they, it will be safe for them but don't listen to it you never needed those wings to fly eight number eight of swords this is your own mindset the moment no matter what happens i'm ready to move no one can stop you okay don't feel that stuckness don't let your mind to control you this this mental stuckness also this person created because they don't want you to leave them i stand in my power you should come into your power pin of swords you should come into your power you should hold your sword no matter who is coming whether this person some other people trying to stop you to listen to your intuition slay them all move forward wherever your intuition is guiding okay because you never needed those things to fly no one is keeping you stuck here it is your own mindset because you gave importance to the other people to feed your brain train your brain such a way where it became stuck now so now you want to take the plunge now we want to go forward move forward also those things are affecting those mental thoughts are affecting you become queen of swords okay thank you for watching pile number 4 who choose lovers okay so who may ever choose lovers card who is trying to dim your light okay so meanwhile go and subscribe if at all you not subscribe if at all you already subscribed thank you for the subscription click the join button and have a look at our youtube store watch the ads so who is trying to dim my pile number 4's light ace of pentacles who is trying to dim my pile number 4's light tower is trying to dim hey i'm not seeing anything <laughs> Who is trying to dim your light? I am unstoppable. Listen that song. What is the tower moment? What is the tower? What is this seven of cups? I think here no one is stopping you. I, if at all, someone is trying to do also. Maybe you already uh, outgrown because your counterpart is coming. You are getting some new beginning. You both are going to build ten of pentacles. You are going to get some ace of one new beginning. If at all anyone stopping also, it is not at all. Maybe you don't bother about all those things. You are getting some new beginning. Ace of pentacles new beginning. You are going to get surprise. because king of wands is coming towards you as of now maybe they are in some kind of confusion or they are still thinking to come towards you but they are going to take the decision to come towards you 10 of pentacle queen of wands ace of wands so your counterpart is there somewhere around you they know that you are there they want to come towards you but they may be like making plans or thinking or some kind of confusion illusion whatever it may be but they are going to make the like sudden entry uh, sudden realization they are going to get because of that they will come towards you ah let me pull one two cards so who is dimming your life These are like a light. Why is there anyone to dim your light? Two of pentacle, three of pentacle, nine of cups. <laughs> See, maybe here you don't know that someone want to come towards you. They are working on themselves because they feel that you are their wish fulfillment because you are like very busy. what is this two of pentacle either you are juggling with the people this person is a juggler maybe they are juggling with multiple people that's where you may be like uh, okay this person have two people i don't want to care about them but no they are ending everything with the other people 
ten of swords they are working on themselves because you are their wish fulfillment and they are coming towards you but you don't know all these things maybe that is also one reason it will be like a shocking thing for you when this person comes no matter whether you are a man or woman this person sees you like no no one is dimming your light first thing okay no one is dimming your light someone in your life who is like a two of pentacle who is a juggler okay they may be juggling you with someone else or they may be a juggler normally they may be juggling other people uh, but uh, suddenly they are ending everything that juggler kind of life they are ending maybe they have lot of options that is also one reason they are juggling now they are getting some kind of sudden realization that uh, you are their queen of wands so they are like a king of wands so that because of that sudden realization they are coming towards you so you are going to get a s of pentacle new beginning a s of wand new beginning you both are going to build an of pentacle so it is like a suddenly happening it is not pre planned it is not you are expecting and it is not the other person also expecting that person also not expecting but it is your wish fulfillment maybe you feel that that person is your wish fulfillment but somewhere they may be a juggler so that's what you are like okay it is a juggler i don't want to deal with them you may be ended everything because 10 of swords but that person working on themselves to come towards you who is trying to dim your light because here everything is fine but still i am feeling some kind of fishiness yes always suspicious eight of pentacle you are completely focused on work maybe you are completely work oriented person career oriented person you are completely focused on work you are not even taking a rest okay four of swords in the reverse that is also one reason you don't know whether someone is dimming your light whether someone is doing something you are what what we should do if at all dimming light not dimming life i want to work <laughs> maybe you are completely focused on work is there anything that uh, i want to find out some more you may be the one who is in the confusion you have two option one is empress one is six of wands but you are going to see the truth okay actually you are you also have two options you are not a juggler but you have options you don't know whom to choose one is empress and one you feel that if at all i get the person that is like a victory that is like a wheel of fortune at least like a destiny so i should get victory with with that person one is like an empress one person is like an empress so you have two options here i am not saying you are completely confused no you are completely focused on your work that's why the other person who may ever juggled you with someone because of that you may be ended everything with them that person is going to pop up in your life actually th they also don't know now they also don't have any kind of intentions to come towards you they are going to get some kind of sudden realization because as of now they are also like seven of cups maybe confusion illusion some kind of lot of options distractions whatever it may be but the sudden realization will make them to come towards you they are going to come they are going to realize that actually you are their counterpart they are going to come you both will going to start something new and here you also the moment they get that self realization you are also going to see the truth the truth is who is your person because as of now when you are watching this reading you also have two options you are confused but the moment they get self realization uh, one kind of realization tower moment you are also going to see the truth who is your person that's where maybe you both are going to end up together here i am not saying someone is dimming you your light if at all dimming also i don't think you are caring anything because here i am not seeing you are at least to focus on someone <laughs> you are completely focused on your work what you should do two of cups what you should do you need to listen to your intuition 
you you need to take the plunge if you have two of cups it is little bit different huh? maybe see there are two things for you because hmm? so one is like king of wands king queen of wands one is like queen of cups king of cups so it is your part and now you need to decide whom you want either you want two of cups either you want ten of pentacle if at all you know my readings you already watch my readings then you know if at all you get two of cups you will get ten of pentacle also it is hidden Ah, uh, but the thing is, if at all you are not ready with the cup, obviously people who don't want to work on their heart chakra, who don't want to open their heart chakra, they want to go towards the passion, because it is not a difficult thing. Actually, opening your heart chakra also not a difficult thing. The only thing is they don't want to heal from their heart related issue, relationship, past relationship traumas. That's where they feel difficulty. But for you, there is a choice. What you need to do. you have choice you can end up with your king of wands by becoming queen of wands you both can build an of pentacle or you can take the plunge towards your two of cups which is like a deep emotional bonding you share with someone now i don't know who is that someone let me pull one card who is that someone is that empress empress maybe it is queen of swords you ended the cycle because that person is queen of swords so you may be ended the cycle you need to take the plunge towards that person because what you need to do if it is like a testing period for you no one is dimming your light here first thing even though it is who is dimming your light it is testing time for you from the universe not from anyone universe want to see what you are going to choose whether you are going to choose the love whether you are going to choose the pentacle whether you are going to choose ten of pentacle whether you are going to choose two of cups universe want to test you i want to help you if at all you are the empress because we are seeing queen of wands you are caught your king of wands is going to realize that you are their queen of wands so they are want to come towards you after ending this two of pentacle energy but if at all you are the empress you no need to settle for this queen of wands energy because in this two of cups whomever you share two of cups that may be your emperor if at all you are the queen of cups they are your king of cups if at all you are queen of wands they are your king of wands if at all you are king of queen of swords they are your king of swords i hope you are understand empress and emperor not just king and queen now you decide what you want okay because universe is testing you what you want you want to go for the 10 of pentacle you want to go for the 2 of cups as i said if at all you watch my readings you can go for the 10 of pentacle but the thing is here you won't get 10 of pentacle easily you need both need to work both need to build together with your passion fire ideas creativity everything but when it comes to two of cups you both just need to listen to your intuition you both just need to love your love each other with the deep emotional bonding to the to show the world what true love means universe will give that abundance because you are working for the universe this is working for yourself to build an of pentacle this is working for the universe to spread the love to show the world what is true love means spreading the light around the world that is the beauty of the work Okay, it is not that when I say two of cups means two people having the deep emotional bonding. No, it is not just about the two people. By seeing you a divine couple, this is divine couple, divine counterpart, spiritual partners. By taking you as an example, you people will become teachers for the world to show what is true love means. Like Radha Krishna, one way. 
because radha krishna just showed what is true love means love means krishna <laughs> it is not that i am krishna fan that is the reason i am telling the two of cups who ever share their life purpose itself is like love is a light so you should spread that light entire world one way if one couple inspired by you and they go towards two of cups that is nothing but you help to bring one two beautiful families into the society with lot of love not with the dramas not with the negativity not with the dramas not with the toxicity when you build a lot of families with the love what will happen entire world with shine with the, that light of love of light light of love whatever you can say that is the beauty of two of cups that's why universe bless you with abundance paint the sun back into your sky whoever watching you need to paint the sun back into your sky you may be the one who is uh, completely focused on work not caring about the love this is a time to paint sun back into your sky awaken my 12th fifth dimensional chakras bring the balance into your chakras get in alignment because maybe universe want to bring the union to this divine couple okay this is also counterpart this is a divine spiritual counterparts you people are already couple in 5d this is 3d couple if at all you end up together you can build ten of pentacle but it is like a matrix you end up in that matrix life 3d life it is 5d okay i i think first time i explained about the 2d why it is called deep emotional bonding connection it is not just about the two people it is to teach the world what is true now okay thank you for watching so pile number 5 who choose eight of wands okay so whoever choose eight of wands who is trying to dim your light so we will go and subscribe if at all you not subscribe if at all you already subscribe thank you for the subscription click the join button have a look at our youtube store watch the ad so who is trying to dim my pile number 5's light who is trying to dim my pile number 5's light you already came to know who is that person moon in the rivers you already walked away from them six of swords you don't want to deal with them that is king of pentacle now they are working on themselves because this is a practical person they don't know how to listen to their intuition and you understood that this person is practical or you maybe came to know about some secrets about that person moon in the rivers that's where you walked away from them and they are very practical you listening to your intuition they are working on themselves Who is trying to dim your light? Who is trying to dim your light? They want some new beginning with you, but they are in the confusion. I think because this person is completely maybe logical, very practical. Uh, that's where they are still in the confusion whether they should choose you or not. they want some new beginning yes of wands because you are listening to your intuition why why they are dimming your light two of pentacle why they are dimming your light they have two options because they are a juggler they may be have multiple people are at least two options and they really don't know what they they want and you may be the healer or very highly intuitive person you came to know about this sneaky personality whatever their sneaky things they do or sneaky links they have that's where you may be walked away from them you don't want to deal with them because of your high intuition you know what is they are what they are still this person is in two of swords energy what they are doing to dim your light what they are doing to dim your light
maybe they are spreading some kind of rumors about your love or love life with someone who is like a knight of pentacle you both may be share two of cups so they are spreading some kind of exactly i cannot say a gossip kind of thing maybe it is like talking nonsense kind of thing immaturely speaking about your relationship with someone who is knight of pentacle very trustworthy reliable partner so this is a king of pentacle who is dimming your light king of pentacle because you may be have two of cups connection with knight of pentacle so this is a king so you walked away from the king and you choose knight ah because you gave importance to the love not pentacle uh, that is also one reason this person spreading some rumors or some kind of nonsense like immature talk kind of thing exactly not like gossip kind of thing some immature talk about your connection not just about you about your connection to of cups which you share with this knight of pentacle uh, maybe it is like they want to damage your image by talking nonsense in an immature way which they really don't know whether it is true or false simply whatever comes out of mouth why they are doing is you walked away from them because you came to know if at all it is a sneaky person they have a lot of sneaky links or they do something in behind the scenes you came to know about it uh, secrets their secrets that's where you walked away it is your choice you listen to your intuition you walked away and moreover you are like a very highly intuitive person no one can hide something from you that is the reason now what they are doing is even though you are like a healer they don't want world to see you like a healer they don't want world to see you like a loving person they don't want people uh, to see you like a very at least earth angel kind of person that is the reason they may be trying to spread some kind of things what what exactly they are spreading is there anything serious what they are exactly doing about page of wands you may chew tongue because this is a materialistic person they are clingy towards you or they feel that you are their possession i'm the king of pan pentacle this earth angel belongs to me i brought this i i buy with my money this earth angel lunatic person maybe <laughs> because it is a very 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 practical materialistic person so someone who is like they feel that i have money i can buy anything including god you have god show me i will throw the money and i will buy the god i will keep that god in my home in my house because this kind of people won't have home they will have only house that is the difference with money they can build the big house but they cannot or they fail to make it as a home you choose knight instead of king actually they have options they have because they have multiple people they are juggler but they don't want you to get love because it is a two of cups love that is the reason now maybe you are a healer you may be do something to heal people very highly intuitive person like earth angel kind of person so they don't want people to see your healing energy healing abilities they don't want the world to get that healing light it is simply because money power money not power money pride i have money so i can buy anything that's why i gave that example show me the god i will buy i will keep that god in my house they may be going to come towards you or they try to come towards you by telling that no i want to maintain equal give and take because they are working on themselves to come towards you because they are four of pentacle very clingy materialistic person or they have their own insecurities fears they are working on that so that they can come towards you and tell that see 
ఐ వాంట్ టు మెయింటైన్ ఈక్వల్ గివ్ అంట లెట్స్ వర్క్ టుగెదర్ యూ ఆర్ ఎ హీలర్ యూ జస్ట్ వర్క్ ఫర్ మీ ఐ విల్ పే ఫర్ యూ హు ద హెల్ యూ ఆర్ టు హు ద హెల్ యూ ఆర్ టు కమ్ టు ద హీలర్ అండ్ ఆస్క్ దట్ వర్క్ ఫర్ యూ what you need to do 10 of swords give them a 10 of swords end this person completely no need to deal with this kind of idiots what is the karma for them i don't like this energy really they want to be guarded if at all they feel that they are protected if at all they feel that no matter what i do i have a lot of protection either from the people from the society from the god from the universe i am so much protected person they will they want to be having any kind of protection if at all they have any kind of ancestor protection they will lose everything they will lose their protection people will come for them people will come for them okay they may be already dealt with lot of people already lot of people may be uh, keeping lot of grudge for <laughs> grudge for them they are going to come towards them and they may be going to end up in imprisonment or which is like mental imprisonment or some kind of literally physical the reason why i said physical seven of swords maybe they do some illegal things they will end up in the prison what you need to do end everything with this person you no need to deal with this kind of idiots okay they don't even deserve to touch your feet forget about the maintaining equal give and take it is a far 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 thing that's why i said if at all you show the guard this person will tell you i will buy this guard this guard is mine now some people are really ridiculous they don't understand that money is a temporary thing today you have tomorrow it will be someone's make the change if at all you are thinking to make some any kind of changes in your life this is the right time to do that okay make some changes in your life if any kind of changes i connect with commander astra to serve the universe you no need to stop whatever you are doing get connect stay connected with the universe you are a healer you are an earth angel you have some kind of beautiful gifts from the universe just serve the universe with that gifts this gifts are to serve the planet serve the universe so that because of your healing there may be lot of people you are helping lot of people in their life okay and some idiot want to buy you with their money they are going to get 10 of swords okay so you no need to worry just to do whatever you are doing because you are a completely protected person you are like a chosen one no one can touch the chosen one okay so i think this is enough uh, if at all this person come towards you also like no 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 i want to maintain equal give and take and everything with this person don't even deal with them okay whatever your intuition tell you do that because you no need to deal even though it is like an equal give and take this person is completely materialistic that's why i gave that i said that word and moreover they are spreading lot of rumors about you about your love don't even care about all those things okay thank you for watching so last but not least the empress okay so whoever choose the empress who is trying to dim your light okay so meanwhile go and subscribe if at all you not subscribe if at all you already subscribe thank you for the subscription click the join button have a look at our youtube store watch the ads so who is trying to dim my empress right <laughs> my number six light sneaky personality thief who is <coughs> who is trying to dim my file number six light ace of pentacle who is trying to dim my pair number 6 light one thief trying to dim your light 
the reason they want to have ace of pentacle beginning either it is with you or with someone but they know that someone is coming towards you who is like a soulmate they have love for you they are coming up with cup of love they want to propose you they feel that you are their soulmate so they may be coming from the far and this thief know that our sneaky person knows that that is the reason they want some ace of pentacle new beginning with you uh, why they are doing it let me pull some cards why they are dimming or where they are trying to dim now they are seeing the things in a different perception hanged man in the reverse what is that why why they are trying to dim your light yes actually see maybe this person wants some new beginning with you ace of pentacle new beginning in the past they dealt with you now you are no more dealing with them in the past they don't know that they can have new beginning with you ace of pentacle new beginning uh, you may be left them or they may be left you it is in the past now you are single so someone is approaching you with cup of love now they started to see the things in a different perception and now they want a soft pentacle new beginning they don't want to give up that is the reason they are sneaky way they are dimming your light let me find out what they are trying to do or what they are doing to dim your light what they are doing to dim your light what they are doing to dim your light see actually it is like a competition more than competition what they are doing to dim your light is maybe this person is a disordered feminine they want you now and you may be already decided to offer cup of love to someone now they want to take plunge towards you so it is like in a you choose empress card right you may be found someone or whom ever trying to dim your light that person may be like a disordered feminine so it is a not exactly fight one disordered feminine competing or comparing themselves with the empress empress in the reverse because now they are seeing the things in a different perception now they want this cup for them more than cup someone coming towards you to offer the cup they want new beginning with them there is no cup for them because they themselves is a disordered feminine empress in the river so they cannot hold the cup their cup is empty they want pentacle new beginning that is the reason what they are doing is okay your person is coming towards you so in the past i thought your person cannot i cannot get new beginning pentacle new beginning with your person but now i am seeing the things in a different perception so i want to get new beginning pentacle new beginning so you should not get your love that is the reason they want to take a plunge because that person is their childhood friend or they have some past life connection so they want to take advantage of this past life connection and come towards your person take the plunge towards your person and get the connection with them this pentacle connection so that you can lose your love what they are doing they want to take the plunge that's it what you need to do hmm you have options that's where in that options one is an empress one is disordered feminine now you should understand who is your feminine who is the empress who is disordered feminine what you need to do you need to guard yourself from this person that past person 
बिकॉज आई थिंक समवेयर यू नो दैट दिस पर्सन इज अ डिसऑर्डर्ड फेमिनेंट दैट्स वेयर यू डोंट वॉन्ट टू डील विद दैम यू जस्ट गेट रेडी फॉर द न्यू बिगनिंग विथ यूअर हीलर आर सम वन हू इज लाइक ए हीलर वेरी इंटिव पर्सन जस्ट गेट रेडी विद फॉर द न्यू बिगनिंग्स विद दैम ओके यू आर द नाइट ऑफ पेंटकल यू होल्ड द नाइट ऑफ कप्स यू आर गोइंग टूवर्ड्स दैट पर्सन मे बी दिस हीलर द टेम्परेस बट now they are seeing the things in a different perception so now they want new beginning with you that is the reason in a sneaky way they may be doing something where you can sit and cry about the past then they want to take the plunge towards you they want to take advantage of your past connection they want to become your empress they cannot become because they are a disordered feminine you already know because you know you have two options strictly guard towards them keep the guards on don't deal with this person don't let this person to come into your life and go towards the person who is your healer or someone very highly intuitive person what is the karma for this person what is the karma for this person what is the karma for this person i think getting married with your divine counterpart is their karma you no need to do anything i don't know how it is going to work but your divine counterpart whomever you are the person whomever you are going to get married you should get married with them you getting married with them is their karma you should get marry with your empress divine counterpart or divine feminine that is their karma you can manifest your every wish okay maybe you are the magician or if at all you ask to the universe they are going to grant your wish i awaken my 12th fifth dimensional chakras get in the alignment get ready for the new beginnings okay i think you already in the balance you got the balance you are already balanced you are already listening to your intuition or at least you already opened your heart chakra you are a very trustworthy reliable partner uh, that's where maybe in the past this person may be had some kind of doubts like you are a knight uh, why should i have knight and that kind of thing maybe something i don't know but now you have love for someone who is like an empress or someone who is like an uh, divine feminine okay queen of cups so you both share two of cups uh, somewhere maybe this person don't want you to get your two of cups that's why they are taking plunge towards you so that you can miss your love just now i think pile number 4 or 3 5 explain the beauty of two of cups so now this person is like you should not get two of cups that is the reason i am going to take plunge towards you i am going to use our past life connection or childhood friendship kind of thing i am going to use and i am going to get new beginning with you so that you can miss your love you can miss your two of cups with your queen of cups you should not get marry with your divine counterpart so it is they cannot do that because it is a destiny it is not someone can stop that you what you need to do is in this connection maybe you are the magician are just to ask to the universe because you are connected to the universe already because of the two of cups connection opening heart chakra whatever you ask with the universe you are going to get it because if your chakras are aligned if at all not keep your chakras in alignment okay that is what you need to do and their karma is i'm not seeing much you getting married with your two of cups person or divine counterpart is their karma that's it you no need to do anything you no need to do anything to this person just to get married with your queen of cups that is enough they are going to get the karma or simply see when you get married with someone moreover it is a traditional connection so when you marry with someone this person cannot have you okay uh, maybe it is like entire life they try also they cannot have you because this is not a temporary connection this is a two of cups connection it is not materialistic based it is not passion based it, it is not sex based this cups emotions feelings and uh, mostly it is like a 5d level connection uh, so once you get marry no matter what they do 
they cannot get you in their life that is their karma that's it because this is a sneaky person maybe they maintain a lot of sneaky links in that way you also became one sneaky link for them in that way maybe they thought that okay it is a sneaky link so they maybe took take took it lightly but uh, you found your love now you want to go towards your love now they are seeing the things in a different perception okay this is a loyal person trustworthy person so i should not miss them that can be the case that is the reason now they are like no i want to have this person anyway we have connection so let me take plunge let me use my that past connection and i will get them and this is a distorted feminine so you will end up if at all you make the wrong choice you are going to end up with distorted feminine it is like a karmic mother karmic connection not just you in whomever life this person goes they will become karmic partner if at all they get kids they won't get kids mostly if at all you have kids this person will become karmic mother to their kids because empress in the reverse won't fertile like they cannot bear the kids but if at all you have kids then they will become karmic mother to your kids so don't entertain this person just to listen to your intuition get be in this cup energy okay uh, be in that loving caring energy so your intuition will be connected or at least to your heart chakra will be open so you will be in a position to listen to your in, inner voice or you will get the messages intuitive messages where you can listen to it be in alignment okay you no need to do anything just getting married with your true love is their karma thank you for watching